We just launched into a table at Siamese Mahjong. We're going to be playing using the National Mahjong League card. If you're new to this version, there's a link in the video description below to the rules and a demonstration. Basically, you need to be the first player to declare winning hands. Two hands will end the game, or if the wall is depleted. So we need to find two hands that we can play on this card. I typically like to focus on categories as opposed to picking a hand, but when you have this many tiles, sometimes you can actually pick a hand from the get-go. So we have a single seven crack and jokers. I would not take that. I think we need to assess a little bit here. So we only have two single ones. I'm filming. I'm sorry. Okay, so we don't need these wins. East wind. Seven dots. We keep getting wins. Okay, now, so we have three flowers. We got to use those flowers. Let's see, we have a. Oh, I see a quint in here. Flowers, green dragons, and five bams. Maybe. Let's see. We got to make something out of the other West bits, wind. though. So let's see. East wind. Now, we do have a pair of twos and twos here also. And a white dragon. I almost wonder if we could play a pair hand pairs of twos pairs of twos there is some like number potential in there also but i just wonder if we could maybe play a quint with West all those wind. tiles there and then maybe Eight play characters. we do have some consecutive tiles one here dot. one two one two three or we could maybe play a year hand one, two, one, two, three, concealed, or maybe a year hand. We have a lot of single tiles right here. So let's see how this goes. Quint with dragons and a year hand with twos or one, two, three. Oh, do we need to, we need to discard. I thought we did. So let's discard the nine dot. Nine dots. Okay, we're on our way now. Maybe this the big numbers can go. Quint and maybe a year hand or one, two, one, two, three. Five dots. Nine characters. That would be the concealed hand under a consecutive run. If we get more white dragons though, I'd like to play a year hand. We can quint the five and Kong the dragon. Let's see. Red dragon. Okay, we're okay there. We don't really need that. Here's the three. Let's just keep all the one, two, threes. One, two, three, one, two, three, two, three, two, three. We have no fours though. That's why I was thinking about one, two, one, two, three. Nine characters. Or like numbers Sounds with twos. Oh, there's dragons now. Look at the dragons here. Maybe we could use these dra these two down here and go with a red dragon. Eight so like numbers with twos, but we'll need more flowers. And six characters. We need a white dragon in there. Twos. Our multiples are with the twos. We do have one here with the one. One, two, one, two, three, crack. Nine or numbers. like numbers with twos if we can get flowers. There's another three. Seven dots. Two, three, two, three. 
If we can get a four One crack, maybe. we could maybe do two, three, two, three, four. West wind. I still think like numbers with twos or a year hand might work too. There's a one dot out right now. There's a five dot now. Six dots. We have one through five, pung of twos, Two gap four. There's a joker though. We could quint the flower now. So we have to make a choice now. I think the three bam can go. Three bam. Three bamboos. One, two, one, two, three crack. No gaps. Eight characters. I don't think Eight I would play bamboos. one through five because we have a gap of no four, even though we could use jokers. Seven dots. But we'd Six have to throw bamboos. away a, a, a two, a two dot. And we'd have to throw away two pair here. Eight Either way, we're going to discard. Ooh, there's another, there's another joker. Okay, so let's let the five dot go. Five dot. All right, now let's see what we could do here. What about one, two? I was just thinking maybe we could try another quint. Nine bamboos. One, oh, there's a one. One, two, one, two, three, crack. Okay, so what we need up here, we need a three crack in here. We can use this for the one, maybe. One character. Three bam, we already let go. Three bamboos. Green dragon. Seven characters. We can maybe use this, there's the three crack. Okay, so we've got that now, I think. Let's let the three dot go. The green three dragon. Dots. There's only, there are no green dragons out right now. Nine bamboos. Eight characters. One, two, one, two, three, crack. Concealed hand, which is nice. If we get the tiles early enough, we might three be able characters. to do a conceit, uh, pure, a pure hand. That would be a Seven 60 characters. point hand if we could do it. Two bamboos. Nope, we're concealed, so we're going to have to stay quiet. Eight bamboos. Green dragon. Okay, let's Kong. Kong. Three dots. We can quit both of these. North wind. Eight bamboos. We're, we're one away from ready on this concealed hand. And we need to quint these two blocks. Oh, we got the one. Okay, now we're ready to win on a one bam or two one bam. Dragon. I would love to do that pure if we can. Use this joker up here. Six bamboos. West wind. Use this up here. Six bamboos. We need a one bam or a two bam and we Three can do dots. this pure. I love playing pure hands. Six bamboos. Sometimes it's a push though. You gotta push it. One character. And it is risky. We're in the end game right now. Red dragon. Pass. Eight dots. So if a one bam or two bam are, is Southwind. discarded, we can move a joker Five down. Dots. We probably should go ahead and do that anyway because we're in the end game. Two characters. Two characters. One one bam and one two bam have been discarded already by our opponent. So if they draw it, they will likely discard it. They just discarded a two crack, so I'm not sure why the hesitation Hope we're not stuck again. No, we're not stuck. No five bams are Six out, dots. and no flowers are out either. South wind. Three 
one bamboo. Okay, there we go. We've got to take it. Because if we don't, we won't be able to make it pure anyway. So we're going to mahjong. And now we're going to try to get this Red quint. Dragon. Now this quint, if we do get it, will be double value. This is a 40-point hand. So if we get it, that will be an 80-point hand. Nine so right now, that's a 30-point hand. North wind. Seven bamboos. That seven bam is a fresh tile. Has not been discarded Kong. yet. There's a Kong, pure Kong. White dragon. Six characters. So we're looking for a flower and a five bam, and neither have been discarded. Green dragon. Oh, they got a joker. White dragon. Three characters. Six characters. Seven dot. Three are out. Seven dots. All right. We have nine more picks. They may have a risky discard. Let's hope it's a flower. Or maybe we could pick one. Because right now they don't know. That'll do! Red dragon. A joker will do! We're ready to win on a flower or a five bam. And we are semi-stealth. There it is. Mahjong on the quint. This will be a nice score. It looks like... They were ready to win also, so they were risking it. Sometimes you got to risk it. You never know who's going to win. And they had no declared wins out, so they kind of had to. So we have consecutive run concealed, 30 points, and then a quint, 40 points. But since it was the second win, it's doubled. Then this player has a negative 20 because they discarded into uh, the second hand. If you discard into... The second winning hand, you get a penalty. They were ready to win on five, six, seven. They actually have a winning hand there, but they were waiting for double mahjong because their that hand is a winning hand, second hand down under consecutive run. And then here, they were waiting for either a four bam or a four dot. Four bam or four dot. No, the four bam was in the wall. The four dot, one was discarded, the other in the wall. I think the risk was worth it there, so kudos on their behalf. That took some nerve to do that. Sometimes you got to play to win, especially if your opponent has a declared mahjong. And incidentally, they had two 25-point hands, so they had to go for a double mahjong or lose the game. They did the right thing. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do. That way you'll get notification for when I post new videos. And you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next video, may all your picks be keepers.